Ah, pues, yo estoy encantado porque yo admiro el trabajo de Devon porque lo he visto en YouTube en diversas ocasiones. Eh, me encanta el concepto de su retrato de entrevista que lo hace en la calle, en el subway, en cualquier lugar. Um, first of all, thank you so much. To, I'm honored to come to Puerto Rico and to paint a legend like Antonio and for him to say these words about me. So thank you so much. Uh, my first impression was I've done, um, it, it just felt like a powerful experience, you know, to be out here in Puerto Rico making art with him. And I've done a few times where like somebody made a portrait of me and I made a portrait of them. And it's always like a magical thing. And like he said, it's like a handshake. It's like two art souls speaking to each other, right? So, you know, I grew up in New York, I grew up in the Bronx and, and I always wanted to learn how to do portraits. And I learned from one of my teachers at Art and Design High School. You know, at the galleries, they always said that like my classical style es como muy viejo, como like, it's not gonna fit with the new contemporary art in the galleries and the museums. But this is what I loved. I love to do classical traditional art. I didn't want to do anything like different than that. 2020, 10 years later, I thought maybe, you know, estaba trancado en la casa, you know, por la pandemia. And I thought, you know, maybe I should get on the train. Y todo el mundo tenía su máscara. Maybe I'll draw them with the mask on y se lo doy, and then vamos a ver where it goes. And when I put the video of me giving the people on the train, Fimel Dia, it was um, August 10th, 2020. It was like 5 million views and like 100,000 followers from that video in one day. So it just kept growing. Y toqué la puerta de mi abuela como, abuela, voy a ser famoso, voy a, algo me va a pasar. Porque mediante el video, el espectador ve no solo el producto final, sino el proceso. We have like a bunch of mutual connections and, um, and yeah, so to come to, you know, paint the legend and for, to make a, I didn't even know he was going to make a drawing of me. So I'm, I'm so happy. Me encantó porque como conocía ya su trabajo, eh, siempre sentí una afinidad porque con todas las aparentes diferencias que hay por origen, de técnica, de acercamiento al retrato, nos mueve lo mismo, que es conocer al otro, que no es tan otro nada. Eh, la humanidad tiene más en común que diferencias. Eh, las identidades se hacen tanto de las diferencias como de las similaridades. Y algo que uno aprende más tarde o más temprano es que eh, más que yo y el otro, somos nosotros.